Okay, today we're going to talk about what I think may be the most important thing dry fasting does for human physiology is metabolic reboot. For instance, you leave your computer on too long, you keep it operating 24 hours a day, it slows down, things don't operate correctly, things start shutting down, unnecessarily does all kinds of weird stuff. Your body's like that. If you don't turn it off, it malfunctions. So before you go to the blue screen of death, uh, you might want to do a dry fast because that's what it does. It closes down the normal aggressive metabolism to synthesize nutrients and process foods and digest and gives all those systems a break, especially your pancreas. As soon as you stop eating, you stop eating any kind of sugars. And when you stop eating sugars, you turn off the pancreas. Yeah, you turn on the stem cells and all that good stuff, but the most important thing is you start dialing down that insulin because insulin is one of those damaging hormones in the body. It's not just some stuff for diabetes, it's used in everything. And if you overproduce it, it causes all kinds of inflammation and damage throughout the body. Retinal damage, brain damage, heart damage, body damage, all sorts of damage all over the body. So one of the best things you can do is dial that down because your body can't fix itself if it's working on stuff all the time. So, which is the same thing as you can't change a tire on your car while you're driving the car. You can't change the oil in the engine while you're using the engine. You got to do the maintenance on this physical body we have, and it can only be done if you stop eating and drinking. You know, people like to water fast. There may be some applications for really obese people, but for the most part, it's a water diet. There's no nutrients in it. So it's really hard on the body when you start drinking a lot of water. It doesn't turn on the fat cells. It starts doing gluconeogenesis. You have to have critical amino acids to make ketones. If you don't have the free fatty acids and glycerol from the fat cells to make the ketones in the liver, it's going to find another way to do it. The idea here is this is the most exceptional metabolic reboot because it really helps this problem with over insulin production. You know, insulin sensitivity is when you finally have so much insulin trying to fight so much of the sugars that are in the blood that it can no longer plug it into the receptor sites because the insulin receptor sites get burnt out from having to use them too often on the cells. Then you have a real problem going on because you can't get rid of the sugar in the system because you can't plug it anywhere. So then it starts turning into diabetes. So it's all sorts of problems occur in the body if you don't do the reboot. So what dry fasting really is, it's the best metabolic reboot for free that you can possibly do. It is easy to do. When you do the first couple of dry fasts, you'll find out. And if you don't believe me, try some short ones. To go without a day without eating and drinking, you'll see how easy it is. Then a weekend, and then go ahead and try a five day. You'll see how easy it is, and you'll see how much better you feel after it. You know, I've had a lot of people talk to me about this. I experienced myself, my partner experiences it. When you get done with a dry fast, you feel like you're psychic. You feel like your mental clarity is so incredibly high. Probably because you've gotten rid of all the parasites that are giving you all these chemical signals to tell you to do stuff and it's thinking for you. But when that noise goes away, you think clearly, you sleep great. It's one of those things that if you've had trouble sleeping, you've had trouble with depression, you've had trouble with all these things, you need to reboot your system. It's just like your computer. Time to shut it down and restart it. It's as simple as that. So my advice in this new year, you should try a few dry fasts to see how much better you feel and see the health benefits because everybody experiences those. That's why the Phoenix Protocol is called Dry Fasting for Rapid Healing and Radical Life Extension. It heals all sorts of stuff. We're not using it for a therapy, but it will do it out of hand anyway. And because it turns on your stem cells, it's going to make your lifespan longer as well. You see, people ask, well, will dry fasting, you know, add years to your life? Well, if you think about it this way, if you get rid of the toxins that cause major disease, that causes a shortening of lifespan, seems to me you're going to extend your lifespan. But because we're turning on the stem cells, doing all this tissue remodeling, all that other stuff, it's probably going to lengthen your lifespan as well. So all the Russian doctors talk about this. People that have done this talk about this. Um, dry fasting is one of these unique tools in your toolbox for life and health. So please. Give it a shot. I think you'll really like it. Anyway, that's it for today. Uh, and I guarantee you'll have more tomorrow.